now here's human music. What's up guys, welcome to Jack's Patch. I'm Jack, coming to you from the Plastic Bottle Green House where we talk about permaculture, upcycling, zero waste, off-grid living and hacks on how to grow organic veggies. Right, so if you've been watching, welcome back. Um, we're in the Plastic Bottle Green House, everything is booming, 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 booming. But today's episode is about harvesting all this food and eating it. So tonight, I'm gonna be going around my friend's house. We're gonna be cooking up a storm. All of us are plant-based, so we're gonna like have like plant-based meal, just put everything together. Um, we've got, look at what we've got, look what we've got, a lot of purple. So we've got purple mange too. We've got yellow mange too. We've got courgettes, sweet corn, cool, not quite there yet. Um, also purple potatoes. So I've got to harvest some of these guys. Um, we've got onion that got pulled out last week. So there's the start of my box. Some beetroot, onion courgette. We've got the watermelon radish, but I cut this the other day for an Instagram post. Go check it out. We've got loads of lettuce that needs using, looking really healthy. We've got the tomatoes are not quite there yet, but so a neighbor a neighboring plot to mine is giving me his tomatoes that he planted them see them a little bit earlier than me um, and he's got them ready but he's on holiday in spain so he said yeah just take what you want so oh maybe i've got one i've got one but in between there we've got edible flowers ready we've got some basil in the pots as well that's ready so i'll just do a massive harvest i'm gonna do a, a pitch for instagram like a big box full of food um but pretty excited tonight because this is like a real like just for me once other people are complimenting your food they're eating your food there's no better feeling than you do all the hard work that like is it's great for you to have that satisfaction but seeing other people have that satisfaction of the taste the flavors that they're getting um full nutrient density from the food uh, also just after it's been picked and look at like this baths me I love the geometric patterns within that the Fibonacci sequence swirling around and yeah look guys got cucumbers coming off the trellis got a few cucumbers in there's only a couple but it's doing a job just maximizing space so you've got the cucumbers growing up with sunflower that I've mentioned in previous posts We've got, got the radish there, gonna harvest some of that. So that watermelon radish that I've done recently in an Instagram post. If you don't follow me on Instagram yet, go over Jack's, Jack's underscore patch. Um, yeah, so I, I do a lot of my pictures on there and updates and then the vlogs come every week or two, but pretty excited this week with this vlog because we're gonna do a different spin. We're gonna be harvesting my food. We're gonna be eating my food. I'll do a little, I'll take a few little vids um, of us guys prepping it and putting it together shows that why you should be eating your own food you see the color difference um, hopefully get some reactions of the taste as well um, but little I'm gonna drop you in on a little secret I've done it in an Instagram story this week and that was I have been offered land I've not just been offered I've been given um, land which is like that was the main goal from allotment to farm I, I really didn't know how i was going to get there but like through instagram someone's so a girl's checked out my instagram her her nan has a lot of land uh, local land who used to grow a lot of food herself um but through circle starts cut has just let it go a little bit and then they've drafted me into like turn it back to what it used to be and better i think i can make with the land it's got which is probably definitely 10 times more than what i've got now which is great i'm going to try and replenish it we're going to upscale everything i could do a lot more better videos on how to how to do stuff um and um, not just that next day on instagram a uh, old friend of mine texts me um, messaged me saying that his parents have just moved out they've got land the horses are moving out 
of the fields and they've just freed up a lot of land I was like are you interested and I was like yeah I snapped the hand off for that because oh, it's just mad like the dream is just coming like it's just flipped all of a sudden like overnight and within two days just been offered like two different pieces of land and I think this is going to warrant me just quitting my job next summer and just giving it a go I mean biting the bullet I believe in the law of attraction I've attracted it like I've been working hard and it's kind of come to it and had a bit of luck and now I've just been offered two plots so a lot more vlogs come in next year is going to be very exciting uh, a lot of collaborations with local cold press juice company um, local organic cafes and more and more cut stuff coming like that as well as the zero waste goods that are on their way um, so my next video I'll be revealing a lot of my zero waste goods um, and yeah just keep I keep blabbing here guys but proper excited so just letting you in on what's happening with the patch and this is my baby I'll always keep this as well as the greenhouse but we're going to upscale it and show people on a bigger level what we can do and how I can help you get there if you wanted something like this as well uh, or if you just want to follow along for the journey like let's go let's go because it's happening right so gonna take some vids of me harvesting the food and then we're gonna be at my mate's place eating it so see you in a bit So we've got purple potatoes, yellow courgette, um, there's the watermelon radish, um, edible flowers, nasturtiums, uh, mixed lettuce over the back, purple kale, uh, we've got beetroot under there, um, onions, basil, uh, tomatoes, like the big, like they're not quite beef steak, they're like heirloom tomatoes, uh, cucumber. Uh, an Italian cucumber variety and we've got yellow monge too as well so little feast up tonight 